What's going on guys? We're gonna shoot a really quick garage update everything and I might show you on my truck because I've done a couple more things to that. But uh, here's my new pickup. It's a 2006 YBZ 450. Super clean. It's uh, 50th anniversary. Uh, it runs great but right now I'm having a problem with the ignition. Let me show you all that. Um, the key. Let's see if I can get it to do it. But hear the relay clicking. Ah, uh, the ignition shot because when I watched it the other day, it's one of these cheap eBay ignitions and water got in there because for some reason, little cap thing that keeps water out's gone. So, uh, yeah, there's that thing. It's really nice. It runs great. Um, I'll have a video of that up running soon. It's lowered in the rear. It's got one of those lowering brackets. It's got graphics, alba grab bar, shock covers. Uh, it's got some beefy tires on the rear. I don't even know what they are, but you know, some nice tires on the front. It's a nice bike. Uh, super clean. I'm happy with it. I really like the way it feels, even though I'm coming off a Banshee, which is super comfortable. And um, here's the other bike I got. It's a 2008 Polaris MXR 450. It's in decent shape. Um, I just picked this up for a little bit of a project. Uh, it's got a um, couple things done too. It's got pro armor nerves stuff. I don't even know what kind of heel guards they are, but they're really nice. It's got a CFM aluminum airbox, HMF exhaust, KTM B locks in the rear. They're DWTs, but I guess they're factory KTM B locks. ISP Bajas in the front, whole shot MXR sixes all the way around. Don't know what kind of front bumper it is. Power mag guards. Uh, that's really nice. It's really clean. It's pretty clean. Uh, it's it's pretty clean. It runs, but uh, it's got a little bit of top end noise. Um, I don't know what it could be. It's I think it's valves or time machine. I don't know much about these Polaris's and the um, KTM motors in them, so I'll figure it out. Daz Banshee ain't changed much. Um, it, it's running great ever since we put the reeds and stuff in there. Running really good. Wolverine, same as always. LTZ. Um, I don't think we've done anything to that. I don't know. I don't know if I showed you all the six pack rack on it, but it's got one of those. Um, I kept these tires off my KFX, the um, ITP GNCCs or whatever they are, whole shot GNCCs. And yeah, so. Maybe I'll put some of those. I got some Warrior wheels still from my original bike, one of my original bikes. And uh, maybe I'll put the tires on that. So we'll see. Let me show you on my truck. Go over here. It ain't changed much. It's gotten a lot cleaner. Um, I'll show you all what we've done to it. If y'all haven't seen it yet, it's a 2007 Nissan Titan. Uh, it's really nice. I'm still working on getting the interior cleaner, guys. Y'all saw it in the last video. It was really nasty. Um, that is not stained, by the way. It's just the lighting. Because I see that on my camera. But yeah, it's it's pretty clean. It's got a factory spare and bed liner, the boat racks and stuff. They're back there. But look at there. It's uh, tuned now. It's got a JBA long two batters, Cajun B pipes, stuff like that. It's upper, it's up rev tuned. I'll crawl up under it. And it's got a new radiator in it as well. I'll go up under here and show y'all. Um, it's gonna be a little tight. But um, here they are. Can't really tell, but yeah, there they are. It's got Magnaflow high flow cats right there, and there are the headers. Can't really see them, but they're all there. Oh, it sounds great. Um, you can definitely tell a power difference. You can see the headers just a little bit right there. See a little shiny thing right there. That's the headers. But yeah, it runs great. Really powerful. I'll fire it up for y'all. Sounds mean. Uh, it's got a Flowmaster 40 on it. It's warmed up too, guys. So I might give it a couple revs and let y'all hear it. 
I can find a place to set my phone. Yeah, it sounds pretty good. Yeah, I'm just gonna flip it right here. See if we don't hear it. Yeah, there it is. Phone fell over. Probably saw a little bit of me there. But um, there it is. Sounds great. It's a nice truck. Sold the uh, Frontier for this. I actually found the Frontier back for sale. I wouldn't mind having it back, but you know, it's a little raspy. It's that Flowmaster doing that, but maybe I'll put some Borla XR1 on it soon. I also put an Oakley sticker on it, but that's no big deal. Maybe this summer it'll have six inches. Alright guys, see y'all next time. Rate, comment, subscribe.